gotta make a video. It's been way too long. Let's do this! Hey everybody, it is Femme Trooper and I'm back from moving and getting married, so now I am back on YouTube. So you can tell that I'm in a different spot than normal, and that's because this is my new games room uh, in the dungeon of our house, <laughs> and uh, it's not done at all. It is not done. Um, I need, you know, I want artwork, I need to work on the cover project for all my Super Nintendo and N64 games, which it's sad because it looks like I don't have that many Super Nintendo games, but there's like 30 something there. I think that's decent. Um, and again, I'd like more, obviously. But once I do the cover project, we can get that started. And uh, you can see my awesome outdated wall here of useless um, discs. That's nice. So today I just wanted to do a quick update on what's going on with my channel because, yeah, I haven't made a video for like three months and it's horrible and I really wanted to just Blah, put something out there. So let's do this. Let's get a video out there. I just want to talk about video games and stuff. Uh, so yeah, it's basically because we just moved. I've been trying to set this up. It's not even done. There's shit all over the floor. It's, you can't see that. Um, but I'm just trying to like figure out where things go. And, uh, you know, there's just been a lot going on lately just with the house move and we get, you know, with the wedding and all that stuff. But now that we're settled, everything's cool and I'm getting Halloween decorations out. I am psyched. I'm pumped and I'm back on YouTube. So today I just wanted to talk about sort of what I've been playing lately. Let's just do that because it's, it's something I can just quickly tell you guys what I've been doing. So, over the last few months, I have been playing this intense, strategic, crazy game known as Crosswords Plus. Yes, this is excellent title. Uh, I bought this a while ago, and I wanted to play it so bad, and I have to say, this is really fun. This is like, you just want to like... I don't know, sit down and use your brain, and it is non-stop. I really like this. I'm so glad I finally opened it up and been, I've been playing it because it actually is really fun. You're thinking all the time. Um, not every video game has to be about, like, slaying dragons or shit like that. Sometimes it can be about crosswords. The next game that I want to talk about that I've been playing recently, sort of, is RPG Maker FES, and I am not playing this at all anymore. In fact, I want to sell this so bad. I, um, this is not for me. This is not for me, which is too bad because I raved and raved on Twitter. Oh my god, RPG Maker FES is coming out today. I'm so excited until I played it and I was like, whoa, this is way, way too technical for me. It is just beyond uh, what I care to do and what I'm interested in. And on a 3DS, it is just not my thing at all. So yeah, played this for a little bit, gave it a shot, not my thing, gotta get rid of it. I recently started playing this. Uh, I needed to play something. I, basically, I wanted to start playing shit that I already own. So, Digimon Story Cyber Sleuth. This is awesome. This is so good. I'm like 11 hours into this, maybe? 10 hours? Which I think it's a 40 hour game, so I have a lot to go. And there's things that are tedious, and I feel like, you know, the game could probably be 20 hours shorter if not for these you know, little tasks you do every now and then, but I'm really, really enjoying this. And you don't need to like Pokemon or anything to like Digimon. It's totally different, but it is actually really fun. I, I totally dig this um, because of, you know, you collect all the different Digimon. You could sort of compare it to Pokemon or Persona maybe, but uh, really liking this. I bought it a while ago. It was like 20 bucks on Amazon. There was like a great sale and uh, I just decided one day, screw this, I am going to play it. It's awesome. The next game that I've been playing is, uh, well, I've stopped playing it, and that is Wild Arms for the PlayStation 1. I was playing it on my Vita. In fact, I got, like, again, like, maybe a good 10, 12 hours into it, and I... I've just had enough. I'm just done. It didn't grab me and I'm at the point now in my life where I'm like, why am I spending, why do I have to complete the game? It was more that like, I have to beat it though so I can come on here and show the end credits to you and all this crap and I feel like 
dumb. I'm over it. I don't want to play it. I'm not enjoying it. Uh, it was like on a sale once on Vita for like three bucks or something. And I was like, ooh, Wild Arms, that's so cool. And then I was playing it and I'm like, yeah, this is pretty neat. I really like it. And then it kind of just went nowhere for me. So I think I'm over it. Does that mean I'll never touch it again? Probably, but you never know. I, I might. I might. Uh, but for now, it is definitely getting shelved, even though it's a digital title. I just don't care about it right now. It's over. The next game uh, is one that I like a lot. It was on sale, and I wanted to play it so bad. I can't show you because it's a digital title, but it is Thumper for the Nintendo Switch. Ah, so good. Really hard, but in the best way. It's like, you know when you're playing an amazing platformer and you die constantly? it's so fun and you're like ah you're like mad and you want to punch but you're so happy it's like that it's 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 a really i remember reading the uh like description for it on like the east shop and it was saying like that it was like a rhythm game with elements of of despair and terror and stuff and i'm like okay what like i play rhythm games like persona 4 <laughs> Persona 4 dancing all night and stuff like that. Like, it's just, that's very strange to me, um, you know, to have a rhythm game. that. But I love spooky, creepy, you know, diminished chords and all that stuff. So I was really excited to play it. And it does not disappoint for the price it is. I think we paid like 14 bucks for it or something. Or if you pay 20 bucks for it, it's so worth it. Please check it out. If you're not into rhythm games, you don't need to be. But it is, it is very challenging. I will say that. It is really interesting. Totally different from the standards stuff that you get with rhythm games like Hatsune Miku or something so I, I swear check it out really cool I'm so glad we bought it the next game that I've been playing recently and beat and I actually want to play it again and again is Until Dawn for PS4 I think I got this for either my last birthday or Christmas or something like that and I finally just said let's do it it's it can't be that long and it was so so fun and the cool thing is is that you get different outcomes by making different choices so you can actually play this again and have a completely different story you could have a character that died right away maybe you know last till the very end of the game if I play it again so I'll definitely make different choices and now that I know what happens I can decide like oh you know that guy stayed with me till the end let's let's get rid of him and have like you know, his girlfriend live or something. So it, it is like Cabin in the Woods, cliche teenagers in the woods and spooky things happen and they're, you know, some of them die. It's really fun. It's like a visual novel that you get to choose. Um, so the outcome, but it's, it's, you know, you're actually walking around in the game. It's not just visual novels. So uh, really recommend this. I'm so glad I finally just decided to play it because it's so worth it. And I think I'll get many more plays out of it. So those are all the games that I've played recently um, or been playing. I'm sure I've dabbled in Mario Kart 8 like always, but whatever, I don't need to show that. Uh, but I just wanted to get a video out there and talk about some games. Uh, I want to do some videos re um, upcoming about movies and manga and more video games and pickups and all sorts of things. Because there are a few titles that I've picked up lately I want to show off and talk about uh, because I'm just super excited. But I don't know what's going on with my setup. I'm on a laptop right now. This is not normally how I used to film, but ugh, it's... It's all a mess and I'm sure we'll get it together. I'm asking for um, equipment and things like that for Christmas. So hopefully um, at least in January the videos might start looking differently. I don't know because I'm kind of getting fed up with this look. It just, I'm not happy with it. That's my video for today. I will see you guys next time and uh, videos, videos, videos to come from Fam Troopers. So I'm really glad everybody who stuck with me. Thank you so much. I'm almost at 4,000 subscribers. So please sub, comment, and like and I'll see you guys later.